We are ready to start our Wacky Mona designs. This packet has several examples of Wacky Monas. The first one, the first three actually, are not examples of the Wacky Mona. They're just examples of the Mona Lisa and some, some uh, theory that goes behind it. So one of the theories is that Mona Lisa was actually never a woman at all. That this little piece right here is Leonardo da Vinci. And some people believe that Leonardo da, Vin da Vinci painted himself as a chick. And you can see by this that um, things kind of line up there. There's another progression. The next one just shows a progression trying to morph her into Leonardo da Vinci, Mona there. And this one shows the golden mean. This mathematical, uh, mathematical formula shows this spiral is a proportion in the Mona Lisa. And a lot of artwork uses the golden mean. So this booklet has lots of ideas. You're going to use the body of the Mona Lisa, but you can replace the head and or the hands. You can do something different to the background if you like. You can put something in her hands. But you have to make sure that you have the three-quarter pose and that it still resembles the Mona Lisa. Now, if you choose to do Mona Lisa's face, that is a little bit trickier. You really have to make sure the Mona's face is dead on. You can change the background. The background should match your Mona Lisa, whatever you choose to do. Here's Khaleesi and her pet dragon from Game of Thrones. This reminds me of my friend, Miss Bauman. Party Mona, uh, Walking Dead Zombie Mona. Oh, Sleeping, um, Sleeping Beauty Mona. Goth Mona. This is Salvador Dali Mona. This is another example of a Salvador Dali Mona. I like the big hairy man hands on that one. Yuck. I know this is from a horror movie. I don't know what, but it's seriously creepy. I love it. Star Wars Mona. Fat cat holding Mona. Star Wars Mona. A little action figure there on the side. And they changed the background on this one. Goes along with her image and with the movie. Oh, she has a weapon in her hand. Unless the weapon is oh, part of a fictional character like this, or if it's a military figure, no weapons otherwise. It has to be, you have to have that approved by me. Snail Mona. I love how they made the hands just like bleh, things, bleh, little organic little nubs. Monkey Mona with its creepy monkey hands. Avatar Mona. This is my favorite one in the packet. I love what they did in the background. That's so pretty. So pretty. Mad Hatter Mona. Uh, Daffy or Daisy Duck. I guess if it were Daisy, she'd have a bow. Llama Mona. Cowgirl Mona. Cow Mona. Drummer Mona. Not really sure what this one is. Steampunk Mona, maybe. Frankenstein Mona. Like, I love what they did in the background of this one, the lightning in the sky, and then the people. This is the mob coming to get him. Uh, dead Mona. Stinky Mona. Even Mona poops or farts. Santa Mona. Wonder Woman Mona. Lisa Simpson Mona. Pirate Mona. Angel Mona. If you do an Angel Mona, it better be rocking. I get way too many Angel Monas. So if you do an angel, Mona, it better be amazing. Mona with short hair. This one's actually way trickier than you might think. Trying to figure out where the back of that head is, is really, that's really hard to draw. This is Rocky Horror Picture Mona. Marge Simpson Mona. This one, it really should have a cool background. Biker Chick Mona. Product Placement Mona, uh, Sac Sacagawea Mona, another Zombie Mona, love that background, creepy, um, Mechanical Mona, Expand Your Mind, Art for Dummies Mona, Mona giving herself a hug, 
Witch Mona and <coughs> Sick Mona. Okay, so you need to have your folder. You've got in the folder you have these pictures here. What you need to do to these before you can begin is you need to map out an idea. So for your idea, draw a frame around the outside. You're going to write your title here. I'm going to make Dragon Mona. And then I want you to just very roughly map out what your Dragon Mona, what your Mona would look like. It doesn't have to be perfect here because then you're going to find a picture. I just want you to start thinking about the Mona. And I put lots of them on here so that you can try different ways. Um, I did this wrong because she, her shoulders are facing left. So that head should face left. If you find the perfect image and it's facing the wrong direction, then we can do that on the copier or you can do that, pretty sure you can do that in Word as well. So that dragon should be coming off this direction. Arr, dragon Mona. So you're gonna lightly draw in your idea and your background. Just start thinking about what you want that to look like. So that's a little castle in the background. Maybe a little road coming in, maybe some mountains there. Okay. Once you have some ideas worked out, then you can get a computer and you can go on to the next step. Now, if you're like, I don't even know how to start on this. Ah, I have an answer for that too. You need to have page 27. Scratch that. It's 27 now and might not be later. You need to have all 60 of these filled out. If you're like, I don't know which one of those to do, then close your eyes. Put, put, put your finger on one and go, hmm, phone Mona. Okay, so try doing one with Mona on the phone. Okay, once you have that completed, then you're going to look for images to tweak out your Mona. All of your Monas have one common goal. They're going to be tweaked out. So you've got your idea folder, you've got your brainstorming list, and you can also work on the backgrounds in your folder, and then put a title at the bottom. So when you're ready, you're gonna make a collage. So get onto your computer, and you are going to type in your name and your password. Do not, do not sign in under CMS, CMS. Don't do that. Don't sign in under CMS temp. So I'm going to type in my name. And I already have my password in there. Enter. Oh, HP, you're so slow, yo. OK. Then we are going to find an image. So when you're ready to find your image, you are going to go to Google Chrome. Go to Google Chrome, log in under Google Chrome. La, 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 la. Okay, then I'm going to type in what I'm, I'm looking for, which is a dragon. Okay, so I'm going to type in my name. Oh, I looked under Google Chrome. Now I'm going to type or click on search tool. So right here in this bar right here, find search tool and click on that. Then you're going to click on the type. So go down to search tool. Oh, images, sorry. I left a step out. Images. Images. That's really important. Images. Google Chrome to image to search tools to type. So from search tools to type, then go down to line drawings, line drawings, line drawings, line drawings. Look for, it, look for your tweaked out Mona head. To look left or forward, that's best, but you can, you can tweak it. You can figure out how to flip it over in Word, I believe. Then you're going to click on the image that you want. And use this one. Then you're going to highlight the image. So I'm clicking left, left click, and then I drag my cursor over that till it turns blue. So I have it highlighted. Then I'm going to have my micro, Microsoft Office Word open. So I'm going to go down, find my Microsoft Office Word, open up Word, and then I'm going to Control V. So control C will copy, control C, nope, 
Vito.